Okay, at least don't make it so obvious. What did I do this time? Uh, can you give me like 15 minutes? Two hours isn't enough? Okay, well, I don't need the attitude. Man, you could run that treadmill for days and that wouldn't be enough for you. And if I had a woman like that, I would absolutely show her off all the time. Because it just doesn't seem like you're doing it for yourself. I'm gonna have to stay here at work and take care of some stuff. You're looking at a girl's picture on Instagram. Just give me a minute to explain. You know, I could look like that if you just helped around the house. Evelyn, come on, wait. Leave me alone. Excuse me, miss. Excuse me. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, my shift's about over and I'm closing, so. What? No, no, no. Uh, can you give me like 15 minutes? 15 minutes? You've been running for two hours. I know, but that's not enough. Two hours isn't enough? No. Not enough for... Wow, I guess you uh, really enjoyed the food here, didn't you? Why do you say that? Well, you had two plates and this is your second one and you demolished it. Well, yeah, this is the first time you took me out in a while. I'm always busy with work and I'm busy with kids. Okay, well, I don't need the attitude. I was just saying, we ate a lot. Okay, um, I'm just gonna get us some dessert. Oh, good. More food. This dessert looks so good. I think I'm gonna order another one for the kids. Josh, I was talking to you. Yeah, uh, what? What's up? What were you saying? <sighs> Nothing. Never mind. Okay. Okay, at least don't make it so obvious. What are you talking about? You're looking at a girl's picture on Instagram. It's not my fault, okay? Instagram pulled up her profile, and she's beautiful. I can't not look at her. You know, I could look like that if you just helped around the house. Okay, me helping around the house isn't gonna fix anything that's going on here, okay? It's clear that she doesn't eat like you, and if I had a woman like that, I would absolutely show her off all the time. What did you say? Nothing. You know what? It's getting late. We should get the kids. Can I get the check? And that's why I run on the treadmill two hours a day. Man, you could run on that treadmill for days and that wouldn't be enough for you. Why do you say that? Because it just doesn't seem like you're doing it for yourself. Okay, but if I put in the effort, maybe I'll be the girl. Okay, I'm just giving my opinion. Okay, what do you suggest? I think it's all just a misunderstanding. Something that could just be easily talked out. Hey, don't forget to subscribe. Hey, what are you doing? Looking for something to eat. Oh, looking for food again, huh? Really? What? Why, why do you look so mad? And, and why have you been so angry these past few days? You dare to ask. What did I do this time? Are you really gonna make me guess? You wanna know why I'm so upset? Do you remember what you did at the restaurant? You compared me to that girl and this isn't the first time that you did. Am I never enough for you? Babe, it's not, it's not about that at all. Okay, look. Don't take it so serious. I was joking. That's all that was. What can I do to make it up for you and help you forgive me? I know. 
I am going to take you out for dinner tonight. Will that help you forgive me? Okay. Okay. But well, I will pick you up at 8 after work tonight. Are you really going home this early? I am. Got some stuff I gotta take care of at home. Such a shame. Being that I also have something that needs to be taken care of, I guess I'm gonna have to do it alone. Give me one second. Hey, um, are you on your way? Hey, uh, that's actually what I was calling to talk to you about. Um, I'm gonna have to stay here at work and take care of some stuff. Oh. Uh, okay, what happened? Uh, just my idiot boss, he said I have to stay here and get these reports done before I leave tonight, and it's, I'm just gonna be here for a long time. Okay, um, do you want me to just leave dinner on the stove? Yeah, go ahead and leave it on the stove, that way I don't bother you when I get back home. Okay, uh, don't worry. Bye-bye. Bye. So, where were we? First, let's turn off your phone. Hey, um, I know you're busy. I just dropped the kids off at my parents' house and I was thinking to grab dinner on the way to your office so that, you know, we could spend time together while you do your reports. Uh, so, yeah, I'll uh, be over soon. Uh, I love you. Are you? Josh? You're such an idiot! Uh, Evelyn. Evelyn, wait! Wait! Evelyn. Evelyn, come on, wait! Leave me alone! Just give me a minute to explain. It's, it's not what you thought it was. Explain what? It was obvious what you were doing! Admit it! Admit that I'm over here trying my best while you're cheating on me with your assistant. No, you know what? I'm not going to admit that. And you know what? We, we can talk about this later. No, no. We're talking about this now. What did I do? Was I that bad of a wife? No, it had nothing to do with you being a good or a bad wife, okay? It's just that you... What? Just say it. You prefer her because of her body. You know what? Fine, you're, you're right, that's exactly what it is, okay? Yeah, she takes care of her body. Unlike it, you stop taking care of yourself at all. Are you serious? I had kids, my body changes. I had a good body before. Yeah, and it's like you said, things change. And guess what, you're not the woman that I married. You don't look nothing like the way you did, but unlike me, look at me. I look exactly the way I did on my wedding day. That's not fair. You weren't the one to give birth. I gave birth and my body changes, it's normal. It honestly just sounds like you're making excuses at this point. No, no, shut up. I want a divorce. What? No, just wait. E Evelyn, think about the kids. You should have thought about that before you did what you did. This is all your fault. You stop taking care of yourself. I'm not so sure about that. But what I can certainly say is that she doesn't eat like you. You compared me to that girl, Josh. And the worst part is that this wasn't the first time you do so. It's like I'm never enough for you.
signature here, please. Perfect. And with that, you'll be officially divorced. We just need a lady signature. Okay, yeah. I mean, this is really important to her. I'm sure she'll be here. She won't be late. Evelyn, you look amazing. Thank you, Josh. When did all this change happen? I didn't even notice. Isn't that why we're here? Because you never notice? Well, I mean, you haven't signed yet. I mean, it's not too late. We can talk about- No. There's no point. <clears throat> I don't love you anymore. If you don't love me, then why would you go through all of this why not? Do you know how many times that you made me feel disrespected? Belittled? Like I'm not enough? The number of times that I've looked in the mirror and you made me feel like I was unattractive. Yes, I had kids. That's why my body is like this. It is natural. I will never regret having it, but I regret it. Evelyn. Evelyn, wait. Hey. hey, thanks for watching this episode. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and smash that subscribe button. And catch us on the next one.